<laughs> Jimmy, I know I'm going to regret asking this, but what do you think you're doing? Dusting. Yep, regretting it already. But wouldn't it be easier to climb up with, oh, I don't know, a ladder? Where's the fun in that? Right, whatever. I just need quiet to do my art coursework. It's very good. Thanks. If you're in nursery, shouldn't it be more arty? It's not finished. And I'm sure a few more toilet rolls will make all the difference. Is that supposed to be the castle? Obviously. The assignment's to portray an emotion, and the castle represents serenity, because it's always so peaceful. Sorry, but uh, you lost me, obviously. <laughs> On. <gasps> oh. Jimmy! I meant to do that. Well, can you stop doing it? Sorry, Kate, but uh, me and Danny, we worked out the cleaning rotor very carefully. Rock, paper, scissors, bog morals. One, two, three. Bunny. Spiderwebs, bunny. You clean the boiler. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that boiler's been backed up for years with gunk and slime and... <laughs> um, sounds like Danny's just unblocked it. Hey, look at this. It's got the Bogmore crest on it. Oh, it's probably just an 18th century shopping list, you know. Buy more milk, eggs, powdered wigs. Listen to this. <laughs> to lead you on a hunt, it's my great pleasure. Follow my clues and I'll lead you to... Treasure! You! With your stupid rock, paper, scissors, Bogmore rules, this is all your fault. Forget about that, I find clues to a treasure. What? It can't be. It does look old, but if there was treasure in the castle, then Aunt Marjorie would have just used it to pay off their debts. And fix the plumbing. Ooh, do you mind standing downwind? <laughs> Back to the treasure. Well, there's only one way to find out if it's real or not. Treasure <laughs> hunt! Come on, Kate. Yeah, well, I'll catch up with you and I've finished fixing my art coursework. Oh, well, shouldn't it be a bit... Oh, it's not finished! <laughs> All right, chill out. Ooh. Attitude. <laughs> Zam... Beanie! Right, if we're going to find the secret within the castle, we're going to need, um... Vickies? You guys hunting the poltergeist? The ghosts are even the ghosts you're afraid of. I think we'll pass. There. Everyone except me got to see it. I mean, you guys didn't even believe me until you got here. But we're looking for something better than the poltergeist. Treasure. <laughs> no, thanks. What's up with your family? And Kate would rather be doing homework, and you'd rather do whatever it is you're doing. I'm working on a new trick. Ladies and gentlemen, I will now make this egg disappear. <laughs> like I didn't expect that to happen. It's a work in progress. Ah, oh, I liked it. Right, we all set? All set for what? Oh, we've gone on a treasure hunt. I found this in the library. Let me see that. I mean, it was Jimmy's idea, so it's probably nothing, but... I'm afraid you're right, my lady. This is nothing. No, it's for real. I remember something about treasure when I was little. Well, I was actually the same size I was now. Oh, you know what I mean. That was just an old legend. So, there was a legend about treasure in the castle? Well, this could be real. I mean, Jimmy, I mean, we could have found the secret to actual bountiful booty. Imagine what we could do with it. <laughs> We'll split it. Or we could settle it by rock, paper, scissors. Bogmore style? No. Fine, 50 50. Shake. <laughs> so, what's after the leading us to treasure part? Um, if you read the right passage in the right book, you'll find my secret by hook or by crook. But the library, it's full of books. Wait! You can't. If you do, something terrible will happen. What, we'll become mega rich? Oh, yeah, that'd be awful. Exactly. Best just to leave it. Why don't you want us to find the treasure? Because of a very good reason. That I will tell you in the fullness of time. No, wait! I've got it. According to um, the legend, the treasure is guarded by a poltergeist. So if you go poking around, you're just gonna wake it. Wait, the poltergeist? I'm in. Do you see a grand few things and I'll meet you in the library? You'll be scared and terrified? Yeah, but we'll be able to afford for therapy to get over it, so come on. <laughs> if you read the right passage in the right book, you'll find my next clue by hook or by crook. 
The man seriously needs to work on his lyrics. It's obviously saying we need to take the secret passage. Obviously, but for the sake of the others, do you fancy explaining how you figured that out? The right passage in the right book. Of course. The secret passage was opened by one of these books. Now, which one was it? Ah, yes. This one. <laughs> Watch it. You're not finished that yet. It's hard to concentrate when people are flinging books at you. Is that meant to be the castle? That reminds you of the stuff we used to do in nursery school. <laughs> it's a representation of serenity. And it's not finished. <laughs> it's, it's good. It's, it's very good. Sure it was one of these ones. Hmm. I don't know why Gabe wouldn't come. He loved playing treasure hunts on me, OK? What's the worst that can happen? We're already dead. Oh, well, there's a nice cheery thought to take with us down this dark and gloomy passageway. <laughs> oh, it was just a cobweb brushed against my face. Gay was right. Maybe this is too scary for you. I'm fine. And you can let go of my hand any time you want now, Jimmy. I'm just holding your hand because I need you to get scared. Hello! Anyone there? What are you doing? Chattering oh. poltergeist. Well, don't. See? Wait, wait, stop that. That was just the wind, right? <laughs> Turn back! This is not the wind! <laughs> Tell me twice! <laughs> we go on and never return! This is amazing. Poltergeists don't usually talk. No, they don't. And I know that voice. <laughs> Why are you looking in there? Can't you even hide in a wall like a proper ghost? <laughs> oh, this is embarrassing. What's with you? Trying to scare us like that. Well, not me, but Leo. I wasn't scared. Yes, you were. Look, there is a perfectly simple explanation for all this. I'm off. I just can't tell you what it is. Look, I don't know what you think is going to happen, but even if you're afraid to have fun for some weird reason, you should at least let us enjoy ourselves. Shame on you. <laughs> Serenity. Just need a book. See. Supernatural. Paranormal. Ah, here we go. Phantoms and poltergeists. Did you find the treasure yet? No. All we found was gay pretending to be the poltergeist. But I'm going to find the real one. Of course you are. If you read the right passage, you read the right book. You'll find my next clue by hook or by crook. Saved your life. What did he left that open? Who cares? Anyone seen anything treasury? Nope. But there is a shepherd's crook. Oh, you'll find the secret by hook or by crook. Oh, no treasure. But there is another clue. If you're out of the gloom, you got the first part right. But you'll stay in the dark if you don't see the light. <laughs> Easy. See the light. I've watched enough haunted movies to know that the secret panel is operated by that candlelight. <laughs> oh. Okay, now like, this has to be the one. Stop, you're wrecking the place. Relax. Once we find the treasure, we'll have enough money to pay for repairs. True. Anyways, all this old stuff's going once we turn this place into a paintball arena. Exactly. Wait, what paintball arena? There is no paintball arena. Not yet, but there will be. No, we're going to restore its original features and features so we can hire out the castle for weddings and business conferences. Wow, you actually managed to make living in a castle sound boring. Your idea of boring is anything that isn't completely ridiculous. I mean, what happens after paintballing? You're going to turn the ballroom into an ice rink? 
That was a joke. <laughs> Ahem, while you two are planning your paintball weddings, shouldn't you be asking the people who've been living here for over 250 years? I want stuff too, you know, like a games room, a surround sound system. Esme, we all want stuff, but the important thing is figuring out how to make the most of the castle. Exactly, a premier attraction for extreme sports. <laughs> no, a tasteful retreat and health spa for people who want to get away from it all. Everyone around is already away from it all. They want excitement. Tourists want old world charm. It will have old world charm and new world paintball. You know what? Forget 50-50. I'll decide what we spend the treasure on. Not if I find it first. You're wrong. Win it takes all. Esme, you can witness it. Esme? Where'd she go? She must have figured out the clue. She's trying to beat us to the treasure. What? The double crossing turncoat. <laughs> I think I've seen the light. What? Where? Look out! The poltergeist! <laughs> what? Wait! Someone was yelling about the poltergeist. Oh, it was just Danny trying to throw me off. You've got to help me. Sorry, but I'm on hard target poltergeist search. I got the holy swing chip for lunch. Wait, 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 wait. Have you searched the secret den? Okay, this room's clear. Please, you found the last clue in like two seconds. Danny got it from this painting. I can give you three minutes. Right. You be in the dark till you see the light. There's a candle in the painting. Ah, <sighs> that room was familiar. I think I know it's. Whoa! The kitchen! <laughs> 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 Hi, Kate. How's it going? You me? No way. I missed the poltergeist again! Oh, hey, Gabe. See the poltergeist? What? No. Maybe. Why? Mm, Jimmy was stuck on a clue and then he disappeared. Must have been the poltergeist. Yes. Not me. The poltergeist. But you were saying they couldn't solve the next clue. No, Jimmy vanished before I could tell him the answer. But Danny and Esme have got it and gone to the kitchen. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Esme, wait! Don't start. Go polish the armor or whatever it is you do for fun. I'm finding the treasure. You figured out where it is? No, I thought it was in there, but... It's just not the clue. You'll find what you seek at the end of my rhyme. I hope you find it before tea time. Why is it bad poetry? Just say, the treasure is here. Bang, go get it. <laughs> Maybe I can help. Really? Why now? You know what they say. If you can't beat them, stop trying to beat them. Now you're on to something. No, really. I want to find it too, so I can buy more lacy cuffs. That's right, Gabriel. Keep dreaming the dream. Fine, you can have a cut, but I've been on the hunt longer, so we'll split it 60-40. Fine. Ha! You agreed too quickly. Now it's 80-20. Fine. <laughs> At the end of my rhyme, I hope you find it before tea time. There's a tea set there. They're both empty. I've got it. Um, it's the tar. At the top, in the small attic room. How did you get all that from a clue? Simple. Um, tea time. Um, tea for tar and time um, because it's the old clock tar. Brilliant. <laughs> you vandal. I'd finally finished and you've ruined it. You sure? It's hard to tell. <laughs> Oh, I'm sorry about your homework, but you've got to help me. If Danny finds the treasure, she's going to turn this place into my worst nightmare. <laughs> I won't last five minutes. If you help me find the treasure, I'll split it with you and buy you some proper art. The only thing I'd do with the treasure is pay someone to put you on a space rocket and blast you to the dark side of the moon. So, just to be clear, are you going to help me or not? Where's Esme? Um, she left. 
She found the next clue. Yes, and she went to the tower. If you hurry, you could catch her. Thanks. Hang on. Why are you trying to get rid of me? What are you up to? Nothing. <laughs> Just winding the clock. Yeah, like how you were winding me up. There's nothing in that tower. I'm on to you, Gabe. You just want all the treasure for yourself. <gasps> Is that true? No, I swear. I wouldn't want it. He's lying. He wants to buy more lacy cuffs. He even said so. Come <laughs> <laughs> on, guys. Hello, how are you? Leah, I'm trying to find the others. Did you solve the painting clue? What? Oh, yeah, it meant the kitchen. Oh, great, you're a star. Uh, wait, when you were missing out, you were you kidnapped by the party guys. No. <laughs> Thanks a million. Go. You know more than you're saying, Gabe. Now, what does this clue mean? Tell us or we'll... we'll actually, what can you do to a ghost? Why can't you just trust me? No good can come of the treasure. Save it. I'm not letting you turn this place into a tacky theme park. Can we have a time up before we start arguing, please? Anyone else hungry? Hang on. That clock's got to be wrong. It must be nearly tea time. Tea time! Oh, so we're all agreed. Forget it. That clock hasn't worked since we were children. Then why did you say you were winding it? What time's tea time? Um, four o'clock? Yeah. Four o'clock. Oh, it's another clue. Okay, thank you. See you later. You can't solve it on your own. Good point. That's right. We'll team up. I'll split it with you. Stop this! Can't you see this is tearing us apart? <laughs> I knew something would be torn apart. Esme, I still have half. We can stop Danny's project boring before it starts. No, Esme. Join me. We can stop Jimmy from wrecking your family home with his stupid stupidity. You'll still have Wi-Fi, right? The best Wi-Fi money can buy. I'll put in Wi-Fi too. Yeah, well, I can get the latest design and ship from around the world. I'll get you your own robot butler. <laughs> we have a winner. Woo, let's go. Esme, wait! Oh. You can't get rid of me that easily. Wherever you go, I'll go. Look out, the vault guys! As if I'm gonna fall for the same trick I pulled on you. You're right. So I guess I'll just lock you in here till we find the treasure. What? No, 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 no! Jimmy, get me out! Hi, Danny. <laughs> Aw, no poltergeist. It's just you. Oh, well, nice to see you too, Leo. Hey! Watch it! Sorry. <sighs> there. Out of harm's way. No! Forget about it. When Esme and Jimmy have gone to search for the treasure without me, and I really, really need you to help me solve the last clue. What, just leave it? I, no, I, I can't do that. <laughs> I'm going to make... A perfect representation of serenity, even if it kills me. <laughs> Nothing will distract me. Well, if you help me find the treasure, then I will refit Prince William's stable. New saddle. Keep talking. <laughs> Gold bridle. Or you can eat oat buffet. OK, I'll do it. Only for Prince William. And I'll put a water slide. From my bedroom to the pool. <laughs> Slow down, Grand Designs. We haven't found them yet. We still only have half the clue, remember? You've solved them all, there's treasure ahead. That's it. That's all we've got. You've solved them all, there's treasure ahead. But you'll need Cooper's key or the hunt is dead. Well, maybe Cooper's one of your ancestors. Let's go and check the paintings. Treasure ahead? Which way's ahead? Oh, that is the last room on this floor. Only place left to check is this cellar. Poltergeist? Here I come. Oh, have you found just yet? No, we only have half of the last clue. It says something about treasure ahead. Ahead? Ahead? Wait, wasn't one of our ancestors beheaded? <laughs> so you want to find the treasure? The left at the kitchen and right at the pantry. No, it can't be. Treasure ahead. It must be. Nice, Moose. 
Good hunted, Miss. <laughs> Knock it off, Gabe. I know it's you. Now, let's see what you're hiding. Ugh, nothing. I knew your idea would lead us nowhere. If only we had the other half of the clue. Maybe we don't need it. Leo said he checked everywhere except the cellar. Leo! Wait up! This is hopeless. None of them are called Cooper. Maybe it's not an ancestor at all. Well, in medieval times, Cooper meant barrel maker. Are you sure? Well, how do you know that? Don't know, she must have read it somewhere. <laughs> Step right up to ye old Bogmore Castle, medieval fair. <laughs> By the way, um, whatever you do to the castle, just promise me you won't hold a medieval craft fair. OK, deal. But where in the castle would we find barrels? I know I've seen some. In the cellar. Leo, stop. Give us the key. No, no, no. Give it to us. Look, you lot better stand back, because if my calculations are correct, I'm about to unlock the poltergeist. No, Leo. It's the treasure. Give us the key. I'm your best friend. Yeah, but Caitlin's your sister. Oh. I am annoying sister. Okay, you found the flaw in my argument. Oh, yeah. But if you give us the key, we'll buy you all the magic tricks you want. If you give us the key, I'll let you saw Danny in half. <laughs> Look, <laughs> I don't care about your stupid treasure. I just want to see the poltergeist. again. Stop! I can't let you open the door. It's not what you think. Just leave it be. Oh, why are you always trying to stop us, Gabe? Gabe! Why are you lurking in there? Why are you trying to get rid of me? What are you up to? Winding the clock. Then. Well, even though there's a treasure in there that could pay off all our debts and do up the castle, so we'll just forget about it. Thank you. I knew you'd understand. I was joking. Why does no one get it when I'm being sarcastic? Enough! <laughs> We're finding the treasure and that's that! What is this? It's like a bunch of old junk that's been put into storage. There! I miss Hedy doll. I kept asking one, but I never got it. After all that, no treasure. And no scary ghosts. Although that doll is pretty terrifying. <laughs> Why is he trying to stop us from finding this mouldy old stuff? I made the treasure hunt. What? Why? For a laugh? So you can see us running around for your own amusement? Why don't you just tell us? I made it 250 years ago. For Esme. The treasure was a surprise birthday masquerade ball. I don't remember that. No, you wouldn't. It was for your 11th birthday. But a few days before, I got the flu. And then you got the flu. And then, you know the rest. You mean? We didn't have a party because this was the birthday that you never got to celebrate. This is why I did not want you to do the treasure hunt. I did not want to remind Esme of all the birthdays that she'd missed out on. Esme, we're so sorry. We didn't know. Are you OK? I'm better than OK. This is brilliant. The way Gabe just described it sounds like a bit of a downer. Do you see what this means? I haven't had a birthday party in 250 years. So you owe me 250 years worth of birthday presents! Oh! There wasn't enough room for 261 candles. Happy birthdays. You don't look a day over 200. <laughs> Yay! Yay! Do you want a special birthday magic trick? Sure. I, Leo the Magnificent, will now make this egg disappear. <laughs> no! <laughs> Thanks, Gabe. Great party. Just like the ones we used to have. Only with better music.
It's hard to bust moves to a high score. <laughs> I'm now for your next.